a new Paper Mario, Star Fox Horizon, a new Final Fantasy game for 3DS, DLC, release dates, Amiibos, trailers, everything has been leaked for the Nintendo Direct of April 1st. My name is Your Raptor, and I will tell you everything you need to know about what Nintendo will show. So first I wanted to do a prediction video about this Nintendo Direct of April 1st, but then I saw this leak and it looks really real. It's from a um, Nintendo of Europe employee. It was all in German, but it's now translated to English and it looks, like I said, really real. Um, so first, it's really happening. There's really a Nintendo Direct on April 1st or April 2nd in Europe. That is now April Fools, so we got that out of the way. And I will now tell you all the most awesome announcements that will happen during this Nintendo Direct. A new Paper Mario will be announced for Winter 2015, because of course Zelda is delayed. We get to see a first trailer and more info will be shown during the E3. Final Fantasy Explorers will be localized, something I predicted by the way in my last Nintendo Direct prediction video, and it will come later this year to Nintendo 3DS. I'm really excited for this one, it looks really awesome to play with a lot of friends. There will be a Nintendo anime channel coming to the Wii U and Nintendo 3DS on April 9th in Europe. Awesome! So now we can watch our animes on a Nintendo platform. Yeah, I think it really belongs there. Cool. Puzzle Dragon C Jigsaw Dragon Super Mario Bros Edition. <gasps> will launch on May 8th in Europe and a demo will be available after the presentation. This is like a huge phenomenon in Japan, so it's awesome to see that finally coming to the West. It's only on iOS right now, but it would be cool to play on the 3DS. Also awesome that you can play with Mario Bros. team style. The second Mario Kart 8 DLC pack will release on May 7th in Europe. And there will also be a patch with a very neat feature where one player can play on the gamepad and the other on the television with local multiplayer. So you don't need uh, any split screen anymore because now you can do it this way. Pretty awesome. Splatoon gets a release date on May 29th in Europe and I want to play that right now. Of course this multiplayer focused game also has amiibo support with unique amiibos. Bring them on Nintendo, bring them on. Speaking of Amiibos, there will be a whole new way for you to spend your money on including Jigglypuff, Zero Suit Samus, Falco, Duck Hunt Duo, Palantina and Ganondorf. And of course Ganondorf can be used in Hyrule Warriors to unlock that special weapon you always wanted. Yeah, I'm, I'm, now, a, I'm now a Nintendo PR guy. Other cool stuff are re-releases, yay! Wii games are coming like the RPG Pandora's Tower, Sins and Punishment and the Zelda Skyward Sword. Also Nintendo 64 games will come to the Wii U eShop. Awesome, pretty cool, yes, yes. Super Mario 64, Ocarina of Time, Kirby 64, The Crystal Shards, Super Smash Brothers and 1080 snowboarding. No, this game will not be in 1080p. Last but not least is the pre-order function for the eShop. Innovative, new feature, unbelievable, never seen before. You can now pre-order games, so buy games upfront in the Nintendo eShop. There will also be a web eShop, but the cool part is though, jokes aside, that you get 10% discount if you pre-order a new game in Nintendo eShop. And that's pretty awesome because not everyone is doing that. Like, no one. So Nintendo, good job. Oh, and then I forgot the new Star Fox Horizon trailer that will be shown. Let's be honest, it will be a giant packed Nintendo Direct with a lot of cool stuff, but not that big reveal. And also I think that Paper Mario as winter title in place of Zelda is not really what the Wii U owners want. I mean, Paper Mario is cool, but not of that caliber. Come on Nintendo, I hope you will show something awesome more uh, at the E3. So pretty nice pre E3 Nintendo Direct. Uh, of course, she, uh, uh, Nintendo will do a Nintendo Direct on the E3. 
I mean, I mean, we think they do because they did not really announce a press conference. So um, probably Nintendo will do it like they did last year. There will also be a Treehouse, something they also did last year on the E3. Treehouse, they will just play a new game. I think it will be Splatoon um, and they will show you that um, after the Nintendo Direct. Check the times in the description below and also check a link to all the leaks in the description below because I forget to mention, uh, for example, the Devil's Fur trailer. So there's a lot more stuff coming, but I thought I would now cover the most important stuff like the pre-order function. Uh, hope you liked the video. If you did, share it with your friends. Subscribe to the channel for more awesome gaming videos and uh, I will see you next time. Let me know what you think of the Nintendo Directs and if you will be watching in the comments below. Thank you for watching.